Welcome to Pennsylvania, everyone, here at the Total Archery Challenge in Seven Springs. First time I've ever been here. I've been wanting to come here for the last several years, but we finally made it. We've been hanging out the past couple days. But we are bringing back to life the budget bow from the budget bow build challenge we did two years ago. Um, and I wanted to do a video where we set this rig up and prove that you can come and shoot these total archery challenges with any sort of bow. Um, so this is a very beginner level bow. Yes, we do have a little bit better sight on here so that we can get the full yardages, but any slider sight that can get a full sight tape on it will do the job just fine. Um, but we're out here, we're at the Sika course, which is one of the more harder courses here at Total Archery Challenge in Pennsylvania. So uh, we're gonna give this thing a rip, I'm excited. I got it dialed the other day and it actually, I was kind of impressed how well it could shoot. I still feel and have suspicions that I'm not gonna do quite as well, just because of it being a little bit uh, lower on the budget scale. So we're gonna give her a rip and give the old whisker biscuit a try. Okay, so we got a Mountain Go 84, just a bomb right out the gate. That didn't look bad. The biggest thing is the wind. It's just like this because the bow is so light. That's going to be good. fun. Was it a good shot, cool. actually? It's a little, a little high because it's so much horsepower. <laughs> a little bit right. Money. Over. Over? Yeah. Really? That's a lot there. <laughs> Side tape off. Yeah, a little high, but still, we might have to do a little bit of adjusting. I've only shot this thing a handful of times with this on, so we might just have to shave a yard off. For all the hot 39, we'll do 38. Money, that was actually money. <laughs> Is that good? Yeah. I think it felt pretty good. Foam, good shot. Is it? Yeah, I mean, it's in huh. good foam, just a, a hair high, if anything. So it's still a little high, so yeah. I think I, I might need to, as I go down, as the yardages get more, I might have to change it. But that's really just a sight tape issue. Oh, it's a preparation power. thing. I think it, this is 70 pounds. Really? Yeah. Sorry, that was a good shot too. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. No, you're good. So we are six, this is our sixth target now. I've hit all of them and they've all pretty much been kill shots. So, so far so good. Slight sight tape adjustments, but uh, super weird because I've been shooting my phase four all day long and then jumping and shooting this. This draw cycle is totally different. Wall is totally different. Kill shot or 12 ring? <laughs> yeah, the last one I shot like right where I was aiming, so that was sweet. But so far, so good. Passes the test so far. How far? Look, money. Uh, like, as far as like, I don't know. Dude, right in the pocket, man. That was great. It's not bad. How far? Pocket. I'm sorry. It's actually gonna be kind of tough. It's such a dark. Backdrop. Money. Really hard to see. Yeah. How far was it, Cody? I got 77 and a half. Maybe. We're going 73. Ooh, low, low. Hard target. Yeah. Huh? I put it at 75 and a half to think uh, that might have been a little too much. Are you having to cut some? Yeah, I just probably cut too much. Ah, 
Wait, did you say 60, 20? 600, huh? So with the cut, yeah, it's right here is probably 59. 59. We're gonna find out real. Oh. Spiner. Left, really? right, left, right, good, kinda. Yeah, 59 yards. And this guy is really steep angle. And we got a side hill. We got a side hill and a steep angle. So this is a very tough shot. Unreal good. Really? Yeah. Like pile. No way. Yeah. That's dope. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> <laughs> it's a little piler though. Like. I need to see where that hit. Our arrows are almost touching. No I way. promise. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> Dude, that's so funny. It'll shoot. <laughs> yeah, our arrows are like this. That's awesome. Jeez. Like in the ten. These are friendly. Like, like, like just like a, like a heart shot, basically. Okay. okay. But well, the, the way that's laying it, it could be. Yeah. Okay. Well, we can be buddies, bow buddies. Bow buddies. We can. To get a range on that yet? Oh my. This is beautiful. You got one ten on that. Oh yeah. Nice. Got him forward. I got him. A track good. It's your new long distance arrow for now. Right. Oh, that was good. I have honestly no idea where I'm going. Yeah, 110. Max I can get is me like 103. Cody, how high do you think I should aim? Like top of the antler, I can get 103. Or maybe not that high. Dude, it is gonna start cashing out at that range. Like what's your what's your difference between like 90 and 100? Pretty good. Yeah, maybe. Hold antler, yeah. Screw it. Oh, hi. Hi, okay. You nice. got so much horsepower. Your your left and right was actually beautiful. Okay, we should be should be decent now. Well that was the first miss. Spiner. Still high? Yeah. Dang, okay, so with the cut, I think I'm like right on. I might be even right on. Cutting oh, five yards gonna, off this far. It's gonna run high. So like right in the spine. That's mine. Money. No! That was perfect. I was even right on for that one. Huh? I want to shoot another. That's just too much fun. Yeah. Let's all shoot another one. This one's fun. I love that sound, dude. Yeah. Oh, man. We just got to split the difference there, Snoot. Ooh! Ooh. Really? Yeah. Dude, they're slaying down there. <laughs> that is unreal. That wasn't as good. You're putting them in there. That's a lot of fun. So many people probably complained about this long drag going down. So here we go, budget bow build. 110 yards. We got one, it's probably up for up for review. But in the 12 ring at the carry, 110 yards. So super happy with that. We might actually sling some of these later. Some point at it. Yeah, double longer. So we made it target at number 12. I missed once, the um, 110 yarder, and I, but I got dialed in, shot really good. Besides that, I'm honestly super impressed with this ball. Nope, money. Good shot. 11 ring. Dude, I love this ball. Ooh, that was high. Little high in that one. That's the thing is the wall on this. Yeah, if, you're, if you're not on it, you're not on it. 61. Well, we'll have lots of arc with this one. Kill shot. That's all we care about. Ooh, 
We all kind of all over the place on that one. <laughs> Dead. Dead bear on. Go ahead, 65. Low, barely. Really? Yep. So you're probably within an inch or two of your last one? 66.5. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have put it at 65. Well, there's a miss. Second miss of the day. Don't know why, really. But my other one was low, so. I don't know. It's one of those things. They're a little high, I think. Oh! Did it? Well, first tree contact. That's That was a large knock. Just aim farther away. The range is 53, if you're wondering. <laughs> Out of all the times you guys have done it to me, I can't believe you didn't pick up on that. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh my! Is that hitting his? <laughs> we're all balled off. Really? No way. Complete ball. That's awesome. It's right in there. Close. It's close, yeah. Well, that was a really good group. That's probably our best group as a group yet. It sounded good. Really? Is it nice? We're all really low. Give the double one. Not too bad. Still rocking and rolling. <clears throat> so the biggest thing with this bow that I've noticed which is hard to get used to, is the wall is super, super squishy. There's not like a hard roll around and a hard stop. So it's, you can, you can kind of get on the wall kind of really lame. Similar to my creep tune video, if you guys watch my creep tune video, but it's like you can creep a lot and then get on the wall a lot. And I could maybe tune it a little bit better to mitigate it, but I've noticed if I really ream on the wall, it's a little bit different than just kind of creeping a little bit, so. That's like the biggest thing with this bow, I've noticed. Um, probably why I have a couple of misses I've had and stuff, but overall, still very happy, still very doable to shoot the most, one of the most challenging courses here at Total Archery. So I really faint. On the next one, we got a couple more. Like um, elbows. Yeah. Look good. Felt good. Nice. We sent the kid and dudes up there. Absolutely yeah. money. Very nice. That was cool. Yeah, mine's the way left, huh? Okay. Last shot of the day, and it's a good one. Oh! That was that low or high? Low. And then it skipped up. Uh, we can't end on that note. I think I'm touching the chip. There we go. That was good. All right, well, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. We have three misses all together. So I'm gonna say the mission bow definitely passed the flying colors. I mean, it held its own, did very well. Definitely, there could have been a little bit more preparing that I could have done. But besides that, it's, uh, it's success. So thank you all for watching. We'll catch you guys in the next one.